EA has dropped a new event. Yo, what's going on, Leafer Nation? It's Leafer back again, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we are back with another huge pack opening video, and today we have a new event that just dropped, so let's take a look at it. So look in here, we have the new event called Hockey Roots. As you can see, it looks like a Winter National event, so... Uh, stuff to do with the world juniors that are coming up here. So looking at the master set players We got Philip Forsberg, Zuboff, Jay Bolmeister, Dry Settle, and Philip Forsberg. Some pretty good cards Now you can pull 86s in, or you can make the 86s those guys upgrade to a 92 This time around you can pull 93 master set players in packs and uh, you can't upgrade your 86 to a 93 So these 93s are extra value valuable at a plus one overall Look in here, you got the, the typical packs, which we will go over. Uh, you got a 90 overall Kucherov, 89 Pasta, 88 Wierenski, 88 Petrangelo, 87 Yannick Weber, uh, Halak, Raffle, Yulevi, Alex Nylander, and Bach. Um, look in here, there's going to be more Master Set players that are coming out next Thursday uh, out of 93. And then we got some World Junior cards. So if Canada wins gold, and you have a Canada player, they get a plus five overall. If they win silver, plus three, plus one for a bronze. So uh, that's pretty self-explanatory. Some pretty good cards out here. Um, you know, Shane Wright, McTavish. Uh, so some pretty decent cards. We got 89K now at 89 price, 87 Shabbat, uh, Simmons, all those guys, and some more uh, World Junior cards. So um, let's quickly just go over everything here. We're going to quickly get into the sets here. Uh, so looking at the Hockey Roots sets, it's the same thing from the last two events. I'll be honest with you guys. A uh, huge L there. It's literally copy and paste from the last two events. And uh, I don't know. I'm not a fan. So you can make um, whichever player you want for seven of these Hockey Roots collectibles. Um, and then you can do a choice pack. Uh, 86 World Junior choice pack. A Heritage pack. Um, and then looking here to get these collectibles, uh, you trade in 15 um, gold players for one. Uh, the only new one that is out is you trade in one uh, 87 plus player for five of these collectibles. So um, again, L, same same set, same concept. It sucks. It is what it is. Um, that's how it is. So uh, looking at the hut challenges here, um, they haven't been uploaded yet. If I'm going to be honest with you guys, they took 30 minutes to upload the sets. Um, or release assess, which is absolutely ridiculous. Uh, quickly looking at the store before I show you guys the cards. Same packs, you get a booster set pack, you get two of these this time around, and you get a week one master set player, so it's an 86 plus player. Starter pack week one, you get an 83 plus overall player, including a power up collectible. Here are 30 items, 25 gold players, and here are 20 items uh, that guarantee at least 40, 80 plus overall players. Um, looking at the cards here, they look they look pretty decent. Uh, hopefully they have a tab uh, uploaded here. They do so. Uh, we'll look take a look at the master set players here. So we got Jay Bolmeister who gets up to uh, a 92, but I'll show you guys their 93 overall version. So Jay Bolmeister here, pretty good looking card. Uh, Bombarda Spark Magician Workhorse, uh, Buzzing Applesauce Protector, Light the Lamp, and then Gladiator. Pretty good looking card, man. If you get some synergies activated on him, 6'4", 92 speed, um, 90 XL. Uh, a very good shot. So for a 6'4 overall defenseman, uh, pretty good. Uh, we got Leon Dreisaitl, who's obviously going to be cracked. His X Factor is amazing. So his 93 overall is going to be amazing too. Uh, he's got Spark, uh, Buzzing, Fly the Zone, and Wingman. Uh, uh, booming Shot, Heart and Soul, Gladiator, Light the Lamp, and then Thief. Looking at Philip Forsberg, this card looks pretty sweet. I will say the card art looks amazing. Um, he has Light the Lamp, Spark, Applesauce, Wingman, uh, Protective, Booming Shot, Gladiator, Well Rounded, and then Buzzing. Uh, good looking card. Uh, pretty good right handed shot. He would probably make my first or second line, which is pretty good. So, not a bad 93 overall. Sergey Zuboff, uh, probably one of the better defensemen. I think he's better, a little bit better than Bowmeister. Uh, he's got Light the Lamp, Fly the Zone, Magician, Spark, uh, Bombarded, Booming Shot, Gladiator, Applesauce, and then Protector. Uh, again, 6-1, 201, 91 speed, 91 Excel. This is without synergies activated, so you can get up there. Has a better shot than Bowmeister. 99 puck control, 99 passing. Uh, pretty good card. If you're going to go for one of the defensemen, I'd probably say you go for Sergey Zubov. And then you got the 90 Nikita Kucherov. 89 uh, David Pasternak, 88 Petrangelo, 88 Wierenski. You got these pretty good cards. So 
pretty cool. The only L about this event is how you make them is uh, is copy and paste. You can pull 93s, which you couldn't do before, which was pretty cool. But other than that, um, I'd call it an L. I don't know. It's a, it's, it's a mid event, if I'm going to be honest with you guys. Just the upgrading system being the same definitely uh, ain't the greatest. So they added some more sets here. So you get two collectibles for playing this one. Uh, silver player, uh, seasonal collectible, uh, a couple gold players, a couple gold players, three seasonal collectibles here, and then two more hockey roots collectibles. Um, I also do want to see uh, how many collectibles it takes to upgrade these guys because I actually did not check that. So uh, let's check that real quick here. Um, I think it might be the same to upgrade these guys. So let's see. So uh, to get them up to an 87, it's five, uh, then five, then six, then six, and then 14. So yeah, again, literally the same exact thing man it, it it honestly does suck that it's like that but um it is what it is i guess okay without further ado we have some packs to open all right so we're gonna hope to pull something not all of them are tradable they're all untradable to, to be fair to be exact but we're hoping to pull something good if we could pull a 93 master set item player i'd be pretty happy with that uh because i throw them onto my team so we're getting the ship packs out of the way uh we do get some decent packs here you can see what the packs are uh two and three gold player packs we got them from doing hot rush we pull something cool if not it is what it is we don't expect anything from these packs i'm fine with that so here we go looking at these packs we got two player packs we got a jumbo elite pack and we got two ultimate packs we did play rivals this week so starting with the player packs we got 10 items all players at least five gold players and 180 plus overall players so we're not expecting too much from these um more of the jumbo elite pack and the ultimate pack is where we're hoping to get something good um so we'll wait for those uh, other than that this is good uh fodder uh to uh make uh power up collectibles to upgrade my power up uh, players my x factor players so uh, i'm not complaining second players pack out of the two. First one we got an 81 uh so i guess that's okay uh can we top an 81 maybe hopefully i doubt it but uh we'll see what we get here trevor kid uh okay 81 phillips adina and that's about it for that on to the jumbo elite pack 20 items with at least 1180 plus overall players. Surely there's a purple pull hiding in this pack here. Let's go. Come on. Give me something good. 84 Sean Couturier. Not a bad start. We'll take that. Uh, Chatfield. Okay. Uh, 83 Besser. Okay. So an 84, 83. 84 Samuel Gerard. Uh, so that's actually, this This card's not too bad. I, I, he's not going to make my team, but 84 Gerard. Uh, Jonathan Drouin. Uh, okay, Kevin Shattenkirk. Give me a purple. It's been so long since I pulled a purple player out. Like, actually, Walter Broda. Pretty cool for my all-time Leafs team when we get uh, to building that. Uh, Ilya Samsonov. Captain Dubé. Rasmus Ristolainen. Oh, my goodness. That is it for that pack. To be fair, we did pull some high-rated players, like an 84 Couturier, 83 Besser, 84 Girard. Other than that, not the greatest uh, Jumbo Elite pack, that's for sure. And we're on to the big boy packs. Two ultimate packs. 20 items all of them each and every card in this pack is 80 plus overall okay there's got to be a purple at least in one of these ultimate packs i have two of them there's got to be at least one purple okay mackenzie Weger, uh Ilya makayev come on let me see a purple pull power up icon would be great too uh robin laner so that's another 84 not bad uh lafreniere brent burns klingberg Will Butcher, oh my goodness, I don't see any purple. William Nylander, the legend himself. 84 Varlarmov, uh, Jesper Bratt, oh my goodness, Tyler Myers, Brandon Sod. Are we not going to pull a purple in this one? Casey DeSmith, Burakovsky, Brandon Perlini, and uh, Braden Shen. Not one purple pull in this pack. We pulled, what, 284s? Man, like I literally have no pack look this year. Like literally nothing. All right last ultimate pack we're gonna hit it with the nose and we're gonna hope that there's one purple in this damn pack because if there isn't i may cry i may cry all right jonas brodin there's a purple 87 morgan riley love it that's my man 87 morgan riley he's got protector he's got buzzing i don't know if he'd make the team at an 87 overall we do pull a purple good fodder again we will take that morgan riley welcome to the team we finally get a purple I said there need to be at least one purple in these packs. We got one. Beautiful. Uh, all right. Let's keep going here. Tim Stutzla, Joel, Joel Armia, Jonathan Drouin. We got a Habs pack going here. Uh, Dominic Kubalik, Jake Muzzin, Jake Gensel, Chris Latang. We got a Penguins pack here. Zachary Hyman. Another purple. Ooh. 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 
Who, 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 who? 90 overall. 90 overall. I think that's my first 90 overall pull on my main account. Um, not a bad pull. We might use him, actually. We might use him. That's actually a good pull. This might be good. It's a good looking card, man. Uh, Applesauce and Magician. I do have Magician activated. This card looks pretty good. 99 agility, 88 excel, 88 speed. A pretty good shot, dude. I, I'm gonna use him. Two purple pulls in this pack. Um, not gonna, not gonna pronounce his name. Yuso. There it is. We'll take it. Two purples in one pack. A 90 overall. We'll definitely take that. Uh, Colton Pareko, uh, Brandstrom, uh, Patrick Line, and a Zach Wierenski. But boys, hey, a 90 overall Yuso over here. And an 87 Morgan Riley. Don't mind if I do. So guys, that is it for today's NHL 22 Ultimate Team video. Uh, I want to, I want, I want to, I want your thoughts on this event. L or W? Let me know. Uh, personally, I think it's an L just for the copy pasta. It's a mid event. Cool cards, I guess. I don't know. It could be better. But guys, that is it for today's video. If you guys did enjoy, be sure to drop a like on it. If you guys are new around here, make sure to hit the subscribe button down below. We upload three times a week here. And uh, guys, that is it for today's video. Thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.